Here's the field of trotters for race one. Exacted trifecta daily double wagering. One is Ask Me About It, owned by Parker and Berger, Dean Collins. Two is Hoot Pocket Change, owned by Alan Ken Swain Jr. Greg Grismore is up. Three is Score and Shane, owned by Layden and Burkholder, Burkholder and Smith, Jeff Smith. Four is American Power, owned by Bob Key with Francisco Del Cid. Five is Cyclonic, owned by Marvin Purdy. He drives. Six is Action Mac, under lease to Jeff Aman with Bob Harper. Seven is David Yoder's Major Disturbance and Brett Miller, and the eight is O'Clarence, owned by William Lane with Kyle Lader. Post time in six minutes. Trotters are lined up for the first race, and there they go. And they're off. It was a very scattered beginning. The one asked me about it, went off stride. The two, seven, and eight were both well off the gate. Action Mac sprints right out to take command, and Action Mac clears off the lead by two. Cyclonic will follow him second. Score and Shana comes away in the third spot, two and a half farther back to American Power. Hoot Pocket Change is just in behind that one. Then it's Major Disturbance, so Clarence and the distant trailer after the miscue is Ask Me About It as they move to the top of the stretch with Action Mac on the point, 29 and 1. Passing the stands, Action Mac is leading the way by two. Cyclonic continues to track him in second. Two and a half back to the mirror, score and Shana in third position. American Power comes to the outside in fourth, and Hoot Pocket Change will move with that cover fifth. Now only four and a half lengths off the lead. Three and a half back to Major Disturbance, who's well off the tempo at this stage, followed by O'Clarence. And the distant trailer is still Ask Me About It as they round the clubhouse turn, being led by Action Mac. Action Mac, here's American Power coming with a bid on the outside second the half and 101 flat cyclonic along the pylons gets the trip in third hoot pocket changes second over comes into contention fourth score and shana remains third back at the rail now racing in fifth and two and a half clear of major disturbance who's yet to pick it up two further back to old clarence and much farther back to ask me about it Five sixteenths of a mile left to trot as they head for the far turn. Action Mac is off stride and from the outside, American Power takes over the lead. Who pocket change is racing in second now. Cyclonic is gapped in third. Score and Shane is fourth. Major disturbance and O'Clarence three quarters in one thirty one and one. Moving to the top of the stretch, and American Power was on a short lead, but here's Hoot Pocket Change to take it away as they turn down the stretch. Hoot pocket change on the outside, takes over the lead of a neck. American Power is back to second, score and Shane is closing in. Cyclonic has no fire, it's American Power along the inside. Hoot pocket change on the outside, hoot pocket change in front. Score and Shane gets up for second, American Power was third in 2.02 and 1. Two three exact. It returns sixty eight dollars and sixty cents. The try two three four three hundred eighty four sixty. And back in the winner's circle is Hoot Pocket Change, scoring his first victory of the season two oh two and one. That's good for a lifetime best for the four year old son of In the Pocket from Wise Exchange by Joie de V, owned by Alan Swain Jr. of Port Charlotte, Florida. The winning trainer is Doug Lowe. The winning driver is Greg Rismore.